Hey plant gang, Coralus avelina contorta, often called Harry Lauder's walking stick here in front of me. This is a very unique ornamental plant that's quite popular uh, through the Great Plains all the way into the south uh, for its kind of fun, crazy character. Uh, now every branch on this plant has a contorted nature to that. So what does contorted mean? It means it's like a curly cue or it twists just a little bit. Uh, this is a, a hazelnut uh, relative uh, that is useful for a garden accent, uh, something that's kind of unique in the garden. Uh, in the early spring, uh, even in February, uh, we can see long male catkins appear on this, which is very ornamental. Uh, but then in the winter time, it really becomes a show place as this mound of kind of crazy contorted wild sticks appears in the garden and is a big point of interest. So Harry Lauder's walking stick, this is a deciduous shrub. Uh, you see it oftentimes listed as 10 by 10, uh, but I've seen it quite a bit larger than that. Uh, it kind of really depends on where you're at in the garden. Uh, early spring, a male bloom of catkins uh, for Feb February here, maybe even March or April, uh, as you move into the Great Plains, uh, different regions like that. Uh, fall color is kind of a, a yellowish color, but not completely outstanding. Again, this is a deciduous shrub uh, that really is something that you want to add to the garden as an accent. Here's a landscape tip. Contorta deserves a more prominent place in the landscape so that the contorted foliage can be easily observed close up. Hey, a little bit of an update here on uh, the contorted filbert, Harry Lauder's walking stick. Uh, man, well, look at the catkins on this thing, uh, just beautifully draping all over this tree. Here we are mid-March, and we just have this explosion of uh, pollen-producing catkins. And then if you look very, very closely in some different spots, you can actually see the very insignificant female flower on this. But I wanted to give you an update because really this is one of the ornamental times uh, for this plant, beautiful in the landscape.